Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Medieval Dynasty. So today what we're going to be working on is trying to get, um, let's see here, we got the farm started, so that's good. Uh, we're about midway through the season. I want to get, um, another house set up and a workshop today so we can try to get that all situated. Now we have this little path that comes along here. Um, I was thinking about putting the workshop on this side, possibly, and see how that turns out. Might be able to put the other house somewhere back here, maybe. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll see what we got for terrain. Oh, there's a rabbit right there. Do we have any? Yeah, we do. Nice. That was just uh, luck that we saw it and <laughs> was able to get it right on the first hit. Uh, I'm not sure if there's any other rabbits that pop in here or not. Um, I know that we're in the radius of them, so we'll probably not have them spawn. So maybe not putting the um, house over there. We could probably put the house maybe closer to the river and try to build a little bit more in this area. I don't know. It's pretty forested over on that side, so might try to expand a little bit more this way, but I don't want to interfere with too much with the ducks over there, because those are a really good food source, so we'll see. There is fish here and some ducks further on, but I don't really fish out those ducks too often. All right, let's uh, grab a house, just a simple one. See if we can't find a good place for that. Might be able to put it around here, maybe. That might work. And... Oh, those uh, butterflies are actually quite new. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, alright, so we'll start working on this. Uh, it's going to take eight logs because of the different t type of foundation. So we're going to need... I'm going to just put this uh, torch away. We don't really need it on us right now. We have one log. Hmm. Don't need the fur. And... We can just put the meat in here for now. Uh, we will need an axe. We only have a little bit left on the axe.
Alrighty then, so I just crafted up a new hammer and we got some stone from some deposits. So we can start working on putting these um, stone parts in. Uh, we'll pr now that we have a, a logging thing, like the uh, woodshed, what we can do is we can actually upgrade the roof a little bit. Uh, it will cost a little bit more wood, but it will be better than um, what we have currently, so. And I also put the door on this side so we can, so it gives them a little bit of a path to get to their place. We can probably put a fence or something around here just to kind of decorate it a little bit more. We might be able to put something in here, maybe a table or something, I'm not sure. Uh, when we have a little bit more money and let's see we're just gonna have barely enough um stone here we're gonna need three more stones let's see if we can't find a couple stones there's one right there um there's one more i tend to forget where the best locations for finding stones are uh i think there was a little bit of a good amount over here, but can't remember if there's any other places. Uh, the berries, on the other hand, um, we will be able to get those next season. They're almost ripe, but um, they're kind of like a summer thing that you have to do. So that should be enough stone to get us started. So let's go ahead up here. All right now, we just need a bunch of logs. Now I'm going to update these to. See, these ones cost like. 12 planks, one log, where this one costs like six and one log. So I'm going to go with a six one uh, because we, we're really not that advanced yet. And we're already going to be using a lot of wood for the panels and stuff. So the um, six one should be fine. It'll still give a little bit more shelter. We might even replace ours with that, I think. Uh, that way we'll have a little bit more insulation and stuff, but um, we need wood now, so we need our axe. Put our stones away. Come back to them when we need it. Uh, sticks can go back in here. Although we're probably going to get more when we chop down some trees. Okay, let's go ahead and grab the axe. And... Yeah, I think I'll continue chopping down these ones over here. And as long as we leave the stumps, they'll grow back. So that took me actually a long time to figure out. <laughs> I had to look it up and I'm like, why aren't my trees growing back?
I have never done this before, but I want to see, because I read about it, and it said that you can actually harvest the uh, crop fields from other, like, the towns and stuff. Now, this is considered stealing, but as long as we don't get caught, I can't imagine it won't, um, it won't impact too much of our rep. But I want to see if we can get some extra wheat or something like that. I know we don't have anything to process it just yet, but I, I want to see if it's actually possible. Because I've never done it before, and it's perfect because there's all this field and there's nobody right here right now. So I want to see if we can't get something a little bit set up. I'm going to crouch to see if there's anyone seeing us. Oh, you can't. Well, that might have been an earlier update then. Okay. Because usually you would be able to use a sickle or whatever and harvest it, but apparently not. Okay. Uh, good to know. Um, would have made it a little bit easier to do the stuff, but... Because you can basically go in there and you can steal things, like um, hoes and stuff like that. Uh, if we go into here, uh, all these items that are kind of laying around and stuff, those are all... Um, basically things that we can steal but obviously not the best thing to steal and I can't believe we can't actually use that that's funny <laughs> apparently we can't use that but basically yeah everything in every, all, all this stuff can basically be stolen so all the wood okay maybe not the wood but uh, the wooden here and sticks there's not actually a lot of things that are worth stealing in this town but Sometimes you come across them, and I don't think they regenerate, which is unfortunate, but, um... Kind of sucks that you can't, um... Harvest the... Crops. I thought that was possible. I'm, I'm pretty sure I read it, so maybe they changed that a while ago. But it kind of makes sense, because at night there's nobody guarding the fields. Well, sometimes there's a guard that goes out and checks it out, but it's rare. It would be probably too easy to get extra crops without needing to do a whole lot so I kind of understand where they're coming from all right so let's just quickly sleep then uh, we'll go to next morning all right so we got some clay there that we should probably put away um, our food's getting a little bit low we should go hunting again um, actually what we really need is a hunting shack. I don't know if we have that unlocked yet. Like, I can pretty much do everything else myself.
So one thing I've learned is you have to be very careful of these trees falling. Um, when I was chopping one of these uh, trees down, I think it was over here somewhere, uh, what happened was it um, actually glitched out and ended up hitting me. Uh, took a little bit of health, didn't kill me, thankfully, but it did um, do a little bit of damage, so. Uh, but outside of that, let's just quickly process some of these logs that I got, and we might be able to get one of the roofs done, so. We'll process six of these, that should give us maybe two? We'll see. Um, I got, we'll probably need to chop a couple more down just to finish the roof, but shouldn't take too much longer to actually build that one house. Uh, we will be doing it next episode uh, to finish it off, but um, let's just get this processed. So we have 10 planks at the moment. We should probably make uh, one of those cleaning barrels as, two, barrels as well, but we need a bucket in order to fill it. So we don't exactly have that at the moment. But yeah, so basically what we can do is we can take these planks and we can put them into the roof. And we can get these two done at least. Yeah. So that's basically what the roof looks like. Uh, anyhow, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.